man. You know who it is, man. LBR does, man. Look, man. For me, we back at it. You don't know a video for me. You're a new scrap. I'll fuck with you. You're a new scrap. I'll fuck with you for me. Like the video for me. Watch it all the way through. You gonna learn something for me. That's a fact. The fuck is you talking about for me? But look, today we're gonna talk about why having a girlfriend is overrated, my nigga. Bro, the reason that shit is overrated, bro, is because look. A lot of niggas, they just want girlfriends for me the whole time just to say they have a girl. Oh, look at my girlfriend. Look at her. Look at her. She's so pretty, right? Oh, my God. Look at her. She's just so beautiful. She just did it. Bro, understand, bro. Your girlfriend or your, for even for girls, your guy friend, your boyfriend, whatever, bro, they should be motivating you every day to be the best version of your motherfucking self, my nigga. Not in this bitch. Oh, ooh, ooh, look at my, look how handsome my boyfriend is. Look how sexy this nigga Desmond is. I'll I be like... Shit, you know, man. You know, I'm one of them niggas, you feel me? But shit, yo, stop telling me I'm nice, nigga. Fuck, like, damn, bitch. Like, I'm tired of that shit. <laughs> you feel me? Like, whole time. Because all you're going to keep doing is bigging this girl head up. Bigging this girl head up. Now she Jimmy Neutron, my nigga. Feel me? Whole time. Her brain is not that smart. Fuck it too much. She wild dumb. Fuck out of here. Patrick Starr. Like, she's dumb. Fuck out of here. So all she think is like, yeah, this nigga just going to keep telling me I look good. Yup. He going to keep giving me his money. I ain't got to work a job. I ain't got to do nothing. All he going to do is keep giving me his money. He working hard for himself. Mm-hmm. And when he get to where he need to be at, yup, he going to take me right along with him. Know why? Because I'm so bad. Woo -woo. But the part that she fucks up at is that my nigga, yeah, you so bad. Woo -woo -woo. But when I get to where I need to be at, think about how many other bad girls are going to be after me, nigga. I'm going to be like that nigga Chip Skylar. Fuck you talking about, Icky Vicky, who's so stinky, you feel me, nigga, stop playing. I'm going to be like my nigga Chip Skylar out this home breaking hearts, nigga, like a Kit Kat. Fuck you talking about, I'm snapping them bitches down the middle. Fuck you talking about, feel me? And this is where a lot of girls get fucked up. They be like, damn, how this nigga cheat on me? Ooh, ooh. it's because, girl, the reason the nigga going to cheat is because whole time, bruh. You wasn't bringing any value to the table besides your looks, my nigga. You got to understand. Yo, y'all got to understand. Looks fade, bro. Over time, bro, you, the girl you think is so bad, feel me? I mean, some of them still do be bad when they older ages and shit. But, bro, you probably going to get tired of looking at her, bro. Real shit. You understand, bro. There's billions of people in the world, my nigga. I see a girl every day when I hop on Instagram. I be like, damn, that bitch bad. Like, I see another girl. Damn, that bitch bad. Like, I see another girl. Damn, that bitch bad, too. Like, what the fuck? And I'm, in my mind, I'm like, man, I'm trying to fuck all these girls, you feel me? So understand that shit. So you just thinking you're going to be this one girl for this nigga that said he don't want to look at no other girl. Bro, you're wrong, bro. Because it's in us naturally as humans, you know what I mean? Want to procreate, want to look at other people and shit, you feel me, the whole time. So understand that shit. This is why, you feel me, having a girlfriend nowadays... Is motherfucking overrated because a lot of girlfriends nowadays, bro, are not really loyal, bro. You swear they loyal, yeah, bro. I ain't never get cheated on, bro. My bitch ain't never cheat on me, bro. I'm one of them niggas, boy, whole time, woo woo. But my nigga, you gotta understand, bro. Nigga, girls are <laughs> niggas think they sneaky, bro. Girls are way sneakier than you would ever imagine, bro. They sneaky, freaky, leaky, deaky. Fuck is you talking about, my nigga? You talking about sneaky links? Yeah, that's dumb. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? They sneaky link every day, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? They could tell you, oh, yeah, I was with my girl, my best girlfriend. Nigga, whole time, they was getting a back balloon. They was going crazy in this whole family, whole time. But you would never know that. Because you think, and then her knows the thing, our, our niggas will co-sign for us. Nigga, they girlfriends go co-sign for them. Yeah, he, she was at my house. Woo, 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 Feel me? Whole time, this was getting her back balloon. Going crazy. And then, bro, on top of that, boom, right? Bro, I heard a story, bro, from one of the people I know, bro. Bro. Folks ass sat here, my nigga, whole time. Was blowing the girl back out on the phone with the bitch. Fed me. And when I say bitch for me, it's not derogatory. I'm not calling any girl a bitch. It's just for, you know what I mean, uh, comedic purposes. You know what I'm saying? This is just straight comedy. I'm not calling nobody a bitch. I don't think no girls is bitches for me. She like that or that. I mean, there is bitches out here. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? How there is lame fuck nigga for me. But I'm not calling none of y'all a bitch for me. So don't get funny when I call girls bitches and shit for me the whole time. It's just for, you know what I mean, make it more funny and shit like that for me the whole time. I fuck with girls. I eat pussy. Come on, stop playing. But look, <laughs> right? So he fucking this bitch. Mind you, she's on FaceTime with her boyfriend, bro. On FaceTime with her boyfriend. He think it is all sanctioned. It's all love. Folks ass playing the video game 2K or some shit. Got the headset on and all that. Bro, wild. And he, he on the phone like, yeah, man, I'm, I'm talking to my... He, he in the, uh, the game chat on the Xbox and shit. Yeah, man, I'm talking to my girl and shit, man. Whole time, motherfucker be knowing. Yeah, you know. Man, y'all need to get y'all girls some shit too, you know. Nigga think everything all love. It's all sanctioned. Meanwhile, while bro in this motherfucker, while she's on the phone, and you want to be loyal, my nigga, bro, that loyal shit is dead, bro. 
nobody really loyal no more, bro. When I heard that shit, and I fully believe that shit, because I know, bro, I know niggas don't be lying about that shit. So whole time, I'm just in my mind like, imagine if this was my girl. You feel me, bro? Because you don't understand, bro. A lot of girls, bro, they be out here wilding, bro, without you even knowing about it. Mind you, did she gonna go tomorrow and go kiss that nigga on his lips? Feel me? Oh, I love you, baby. Woo, woo, woo. We're just so good together. Ah, uh, feel me? <laughs> understand that shit. And bro just got cheated on. Mind you, he would never know. You see how crazy that is, bro? This is why I tell you, bro. No one knows Brent Fire is. Fuck is you talking about? But look, bro. But this is what I'm trying to tell you, bro. This is the reason why having a girlfriend is overrated, bro. You know what I mean? If you find that one girl who's just down, bro. She just with you, bro. All the way, bro. Y'all ain't had shit. Feel me? You was a broke, dirty nigga. Feel me? Whole time. Catching the train or the bus or some shit. Whole time. And she stuck around when you was that level, you feel me? And then she see you coming up and shit like that. She still sticking around, my nigga, being a real girl, you know what I'm saying? Taking care of you, motivating you every day, feel me? I know y'all gonna argue, do all the other little shit every couple do, but you feel me? She just always been real to you the whole time, you know what I mean? Ten toes from down from the beginning, and you end up cheating on her, then you fucked up, my nigga. You fucked up. That's not her problem. You fucked up. And that's a problem with a lot of niggas, too, is we don't take accountability, you know what I'm saying, for when we fuck up, you feel me? Because we fuck up a lot of times. But we just be like, nah, bro, it was her, bro, it was the girl, bro, it wasn't me, bro. I ain't fuck up nothing, I ain't fuck up nothing. Nah, bro, you fucked that shit up, bro. Because you had you a good girl, my nigga. You had somebody who was ten toes, my nigga. But you was out here trying to chase these hoes, nigga. You was trying to be motherfucking fed me for his gumpy shit, running after hoes and shit. Whole time, my nigga, these hoes, all they gonna do is let you in they shit <laughs> and go on with their life, nigga. Go find another. Like my nigga Drake said, he said, you should have rep or matter. He said, <laughs> he said... I could never love her, cause to her I'm just a rapper, and she should have met another. Feel me? That's real shit. Cause to her he's just a rapper, so he could get he could he go in her shit, and tomorrow she gonna go fuck with Lil Wayne. You feel me? All the time, so she could say yo, I was with Young Money and shit all the time. You feel me? Just understand that shit, bro. This is what I'm telling y'all, bro. This is why with girlfriends, you making somebody your girlfriend or a girl, you making somebody your boyfriend, you have to be picky. You have to be, you know what I'm saying? You have to know who you are dealing with, man. Even at the end of the day, you still don't know because it's still a risk. Cause, I mean, they can still turn sour on you. You feel me? But you have to be certain or at least 95% certain, man. Because you're not 100% certain by anybody. You feel me? You feel me? So understand that shit. Because everybody going to say they real. Everybody going to say they this. Everybody going to say they that. For me. But it's just the action that they show you within their daily self, you know what I'm saying? And how they come off of situations and shit. Or especially when you go through rough times, man. A lot of rough times show people's true, you know what I mean, qualities and, you know what I mean, their character and shit all the time. So you got to understand that shit. Because it's all good when y'all making money, y'all laughing, y'all joking, this and the third. But when bro lose his job or, you know what I'm saying, when your girl, you know what I'm saying, break her leg or some shit. Now I'm going to show you, you know what I'm saying, who really with you, you know what I'm saying, who really was there for you, feel me, whole time. So understand that shit, my nigga. A lot of niggas, you feel me, they just going to talk, but they're not going to really show you no actions in a while because he was never real in the first place. They don't know he put this facade for you to believe that he was real, you know what I'm saying? So understand that shit. This is why I try to tell y'all, bro, <clears throat> having girlfriends and boyfriends nowadays is overrated, man. You just need people in your corner who really fuck with you, feel me? Yeah, I know you. everybody want a relationship at the end of the day, man. We all trying to be in this bitch cuffed up, Beyonce, Jay-Z, and shit, you feel me? You trying to have my little bitch, I mean, my little girl, you feel me right here? I'm like, damn, I'll be bad, bro, you feel me? Whole time. We all want that, my nigga, at the end of the day. That's what everybody want, right? But, my nigga, sometimes it's not your time. To have that type of shit right now, man. You just rather have people in your corner, you know what I'm saying, who just, you know what I mean, there for you. My nigga who motivates you every day, who, you know what I'm saying, help you on your goals and shit. You know what I'm saying, who's there to give you good advice, my nigga, whole time. You feel me? And if it turns into that, then it turns into that, my nigga. But don't be out here looking for a relationship, my nigga. Like, I'm looking for to. No, bro, stop being, nigga, stop being future, bitch. Stay in the present. Fuck out of here, nigga. Stop looking into the future, bro. Stay in the present, my nigga. Because if you keep looking into the future, bro, you taking time away from the present, bro. Because all you have is the present. Because you don't know about the future. The future is undetermined. You don't know. You can manifest, yeah, but you don't know what's going to happen in the future, my nigga. So stay in the present, feel me? And stop being out here looking for fucking relationships, nigga. Feel me? Whole time, so trying to put lock and keys on shit, bitch. You not a janitor. Fuck out of here, y'all niggas be trying to steady, trying to cuff some shit. Y'all need to join the police academy. The way y'all be trying to cuff these hoes, family understand that shit. And the way y'all girl be trying to cuff these niggas, bro. This is why you gotta say to yourself, bro. If you ain't got no boot thing or whatever, this is my boot thing. Hey, fuck you talking about? Cause you know me, a nigga like me, shit. I could be somebody boo thing, but I'm trying to be boyfriend number two. Whenever she gonna get in the mood. Just call me. Oh, bro. <laughs>
Because nigga, the sign nigga, bro, that's the best position, bro. It's like playing NBA. It's like playing in the NBA, bro, but nobody on the court and you get free layups and shit. Whole time, you feel me? Understand that shit. That shit lit, boy. Because whole time, you just out there, bitch, you were free throw. You shooting three pointers. Nobody playing defense. And even if you missing, nigga, it don't matter. You know why? Because you have no fucking, you feel me? No attachment. You just in this motherfucker going crazy. And you going back to your crib. Fuck is you talk about whole time, feel me? Just understand that shit, bro. Let me just stop talking shit. <laughs> but look, whole time. This is what I try to tell y'all, man. This is why having girlfriends and boyfriends, you know what I'm saying, it's overrated, man. Because a lot of people, they make it seem like, oh, this is my great girlfriend. Yeah, she buys me everything. Yeah, she could buy you everything, bro. But what does she actually give you internally? Does she give you motivation? Does she actually make you happy? You know what I'm saying? Does she actually have good qualities about herself? Is she caring? Is she loving for me? Is she nurturing for me? You know what I'm saying? Is she actually intelligent? Not just look good for me? Because I told y'all, looks fade, bro. So understand that shit. That's what I'm saying. A lot of people in relationships nowadays are just, you know what I mean, faking it, facading it, feel me? They had to live up to these, you know what I'm saying, Sweetie and Quavo, Cardi B Offset, you know what I'm saying, feel me? Beyonce, Jay-Z. But at the end of the day, you can never be them, my nigga. So stop trying to, you feel me, imitate these niggas, bro. Be your damn self. Stop being a puppet, nigga. Fuck out of here, feel me? Whole time, feel me? You're not a puppet, bro. You're not Pinocchio, bitch. Fuck out of here. And you probably is because your nose get longer every time you be lying and shit, but my nigga. Be yourself, bro. Be your own relationship, bro. Don't try to look up to Queen Naja and, and Clarence TV and, and all these goofy-ass niggas and shit. Bro, be your damn self, bro. Hold time, for me? Just understand that shit, bro. This is why you just need to be have real niggas around you. You know what I'm saying? Be loyal to yourself and be true to yourself all fucking day. And God gonna bless your ass with that person, you feel me? So understand that shit. That's real shit. But look, man, that's all I gotta say for the video. For me, that's a fact for me. It's a fact for me. Like, I, I was studying on this shit. For me, like the video for me. You like the video for me. It's a fact. Subscribe right now for me. Subscribe you for me. Hit the notification bell to update it. We'll upload a new video. That's a fact for you tomorrow for me. You know what I'm saying? Follow me on Instagram at LBRDES, LBRDZ. That's a fact for you tomorrow for me. It's in the description box and the comment section down below. That's a fact. Hit me up on there if you need advice or leave me video ideas in my DM or in the comment section down below. That's a fact for you tomorrow for me. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't subscribed yet, my nigga. Subscribe here, nigga. Join the LBR gang, cause it's the gang way. Fuck is you talking about for me? But look, man, if you watch the video all the way through, I fuck with you for me. But look, man, I'm making another video around of doing that shit. But until then, my nigga, you already know what I say, right? Mouth this bitch, um, bro.